Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You are back with Mystery Meerkat, and today we are playing a game I've wanted to bring to the channel for a while. Alright? Um, Mega Aquarium is much more up my street. It's much more the game that I would play casually myself, away from YouTube. Um, I try to bring you guys a lot of content that I think that you would like uh, sometimes, um, rather than the content that maybe I would like to make. So... This is this is something that I really love. Um, it is it is a simulation game. Uh, I have played it before, as you can see. Um, these are the basic aquariums and stuff like that. Um, now, I I'm not sure how I want to play this for you guys. To be fair, I don't really know whether I want to play a sandbox and we just create an, an aquarium from from scratch, um, or whether I want to take you through some of the campaign. Um, because this stuff, I mean, these first two are really easy, you know, um, I'm going to play it on normal, and we're going to go to Elmshorn and play Elmshorn. So this is, this is effectively how the game works. You have an aquarium and you, you just fill it with all different kinds of fish, all exotic fish. You also have to make sure that you meet certain requirements. Um, for specific fish um, so that they you know are happy or whatever um, and so that you the visitors that you have are happy um, as well as the fish and whatever so um, let's see what we got here a private collector wants to build a new public aquarium from scratch and they want you to be the architect they've already installed a large tank to be the centerpiece of the aquarium the rest is down to you get the aquarium ready to open remember to fulfill your animals care requirements to maximize their point value so this is what I was talking to you about a second ago so let's have a look what we got here we got some funky, uh, funky music going on, so we don't have to open straight away. We only got four thousand eight hundred. I wonder if it doesn't look. Oh, we can expand. Right, that's what I want to do for the expansion. Simply because you have more space now. Yeah, I'll do it like that. Then, if we get the heaters, these guys can go down the sides. that and then we can get our walls uh, room stand tool station green pellet dispenser Orange pellet dispenser. Muscles dispenser. Alright, that's much better. Uh, now we just need staff door there. Alright, we're not lost out on anything. We've still got, I think, a decent amount of space in there. So we'll do that. Now, as for the fish. Start off with this big one in the middle. So we're gonna get one, two, three, four of those. We're gonna leave those in there. And we're gonna put them with some of these butterfly fish dudes. One, two, three, four. We've got 36 in there. Now the eels uh, will grow from four to nine, so they get a lot bigger, like double in size. So we're going to leave that as is. We need to get some caves and stuff in here. Um, uh, this 
got two of the filters, and it's still saying it's not good enough. Uh, insufficient water quality, but I think if we... Put another cave there. And then if we put some plants in, you can get some plants that... So I can put some kelp in here. Yeah, so the sea grapes, these help maintain the water quality. So we're going to put some in the back corner there. And we'll put some eel grass in. So the, we've got the eels in there, so they'll love that. So that's the first tank done. Okay. I'm sure the centerpiece has. F it's got to have five different animals. That's fine, we can change that. Uh, can it be House of Bully? Forty-eight out of seventy-two. So we just need to put two more in there. Two. That's right, isn't it? The water quality in there should improve over time. So that's fine. Uh, sufficient heating. I don't know if I put another power combi. I think you can get, what is it, pump, theoretically, you can move one of those to that, we can actually move two of them. So that should do it for now, for this thing. That should be okay for now. Because uh, like we, we can put some benches and stuff down the other side. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open the aquarium now. Uh, collector wants to explore the world of corals with your help. Your next objective is to unlock the disco mushroom and add one to your aquarium. You should expand your aquarium to increase your ecology and science. Income, more tanks and more animals equals more income. Uh, keep an eye on the profits, blah blah blah. Yep. So we've got to unlock the disco mushrooms. Which, yeah, let's just go straight for that. So we need to think about getting some other guys in here. Um, these guys need feed. I think I may just extend this back, actually. There we go, we should have enough space to put our feed in there now. So let's just... I think we can pause it. Yeah, there we go. Um, There we go. So now we can fast forward. So I'm pretty... Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we're doing well now. We've got this tank on this side. Um, do we have any staff?
Yeah, we don't have any staff. Huh. That's not great. Um, 27, 33. We'll hire three of them for now. So we've got some benches. And we've got a vending machine. And we've got some pins we can pop down. You can show people where to go by using these floor arrows as well. I didn't know. It's interesting to me. Put some decoration around, why not? Right, so I think we should have enough to start putting some more fish out. So that takes up two. Let's put five in there. Let's just pause this for a second and do a little quick zoom in. And put some sea lettuce. Put that in there. Um what is the kingdom you like, actually? I've not really got any preferences, so... Do that like that. There we go. And we've got the second tank. Uh, what are these half and half chromis. We can't put those in there. Reef squirrel fishes. Cave lover. Grapes, we'll just put some lettuce, I guess, down. And some rocks. You can go like that. There we go, so we got two more tanks underway there. Uh, what's next? So we got some reef squirrel fish. Uh, we'll put some fox race from rabbit fishing. We're going to put one of those guys in there. Maybe that's not the best idea for me then. Oh, so we got uh, the protein skimmer has been unlocked. Oh, we've got large filters and large heaters now. Let's go uh, filter first. Uh, filtering alone isn't enough to reach the high water qualities required by corals and delicate fish. You'll need protein skimming too. Uh, add one to your disco mushroom tank and see the difference in water quality compared to filtering alone. 
Okay. Um. Yeah, this guy is happy. But I'm not. There we go. I think we've got some reef squirrel fish already. Uh. Ah, yes. Problem with this tank. Me even. Put these guys in here. Because this can only have up to 15 in it anyway. So. So that one. Uh, and then these guys don't really require anything, do they? Um, apart from water quality. So if we put some grapes in there. And we'll put some real stuff in right there. Hopefully that'll improve the quality in there enough for those guys. Hmm. Just wondering what other fish we have left. We've got these guys. So I can do that. Pump some sea grapes in. But that's all they need, right? There we go. Uh, we do, however, need a wall right there. And we've got the disco mushrooms. Cool, cool. Uh, so let's just start doing the fish. Most corals, including the disco mushroom, need light to supplement their food. You'll need to add a light to each tank that con contains corals. The ca cost of the light is proportional to the tank. Or to the size of the tank. Or the depth of the tank, sorry. I'll get there eventually. So smaller tanks are cheaper to light. Okay. I was hoping this was going to improve. It doesn't look like, like it is. I'm probably going to have to add another filter onto that one. Yeah, let's actually... I'm going to sell that and we're going to replace it with some rocks. Which goes to up to 69 water quality. That's so close. That's such a bummer. Right, we might need some more staff at this point. Uh, unlocks the oblique lined dotty back. Uh, has a care requirement you haven't seen before. They dislike congeners, which means they can't stand being around any other members of their genus or family. This means they cannot be kept with any grammars, antheas, or dotty backs, including other oblique line dotty back. Okay. 
We're just gonna hire all the people. Hire them all. Uh, no zones. So we've got two people I'm fixing. One person I'm cleaning. And there are like three people I'm feeding, so we should be fine. Right, what we got here? We got uh, Elmshorn. Uh, it's going to size 9. Size 9, size 9. Protein, skimmer, tank lights. Yep, we've seen all of that. That's fine. We've got like 4,000 right now. So we're making we're making pretty pretty good money. Um, do you want to expand somewhat? I don't know how much less it's going to cost me. But that's uh, a lot of space right there. Um, Got new heaters. Can we not decorate the floors in this place. That's not a bad idea. Um, right, I'm going to do that. for now because my plan is to put a large filter and a large heater next to this guy right guys so I've finished my little overhanging now just ignore these things that are around it right now okay <laughs> Um, they're generally not supposed to be there. Um, but yeah, finish this tank. I need to put some lights on it. Uh, where are the lights? Basic lights. There we go. Five out of five, so that's that done. Um, yeah, that's that all sorted. Uh, the goon tanks, those are the deep ones. Uh, wall tank, corner tank. I'm not entirely sure what kind of tank we want. I think we want another one running down here. Uh, I think we're just going to have another wall tank. Let's pop it like that. Put a large filter on there. And a large heater. I don't know what fish we're going to pop in there yet. I think we got some new ones, did we? The dotty back. Uh, 
down zero of 18 for the rocks there. Easily solved. I wouldn't let me put 12 out of 18 rocks in there. <laughs> Which, yeah, weird one. Um, maybe sell some of, the, some of the guys out of here then, so. There we go, so we got 12 out of 12. I mean, the tank's not full, but that'll do. And there we go, that's my little improvements finished. I really shouldn't have bought those other ones, should I? We can definitely sell the combis. Let's pause that for a second because if I sell that, I can move this guy here. Leave that guy where it is. Uh, we need a heater. We can't get to this. That's a fair point. I'm moving this all around right now. Uh, where's the door? I don't think that the that can go there. And then move that one away, that can still be attached to that. That works. There we go. Right, so we've unlocked, I think we've unlocked all the animals that we need to unlock right now. Uh, what are the goals for this? Uh, build a tank with disco mushrooms, protein, skimmer, sufficient lighting, sufficient water quality, and sufficient heating. Or oh, isn't that this one here? Or are we supposed to attach a protein skimmer to this guy? Is that what he's telling me to do? Okay, congratulations on obtaining your first coral. The collector is currently compiling a wish list of what they want for the aquarium. In the meantime, you should continue to unlock new animals and equipment and try to progress to rank 5. As you expand your aquarium, it becomes easy for some tanks to get missed by your guests. You can get feedback on this via the view rate overlay, toggled using the button in the top right of the screen. Interesting. Default time. Right then, so as soon as we got so much money, I, th I think we'll do a bit of an overhaul here. Um, first things first, I'm going to make the area back there a lot larger. Uh, I'm going to keep this as is. Um, I don't know actually, I might move everything back one. I'm not sure. I want some space to put, well, you could probably just put benches there anyway, right? be fair and we can put benches along this back bit as well. Uh, this can stay as is then. Um, so in that case, I don't know how much that's going to cost me but enough. That's a lot of floor space right there. So we can create a lagoon tank. question is how big do we want our lagoon tank to be, I think. That's a pretty good size. 
Uh, we also want, uh, want a pump. Preferably that we can have four things running off of it at once. Attached to that. We want that there. That there. That there. And again, we want another large filter there. And now you can't get to that filter. So, if we click on this and move him one over. Alright, that works. Thanks ever so much for watching this particular episode of Mega Aquarium, guys. It's much appreciated. If you have indeed enjoyed watching, please smash that like button. Any comments that you've got, leave them in the comments section down below and I will respond to those. And last but not least, please do subscribe to the channel. It helps me out tremendously. And also tick that notifications bell, which lets you know when I'm releasing content. Anyway, guys, with all that being said, until the next one, peace out.